She had it for weekend, didn't it? Just drop back in. I think so, yeah. Admin. What are you doing, 21? Better for whatever reason. There you go. Can you hear me? Hang on. Are you still, are you still pairing? I can hear you. I can hear you. Oh. There you go. You're on. <coughs> morning all. Right then. Me and old Gazza are going to go for a ride this morning. Oh, mate! I nearly forgot. It's bloody... It's Gazza's birthday. There you go, pal. Hope you've, hope you've got a uh, room. <laughs> Happy birthday, my man. Thank you, brother. <laughs> Good lad. I almost forgot. Just been chat stood here chatting. Thinking, I'm sure there's something I should be doing. That's it. Give your guys his bloody birthday present. Hold on. Is this a new bottle or is this one out of the collection again? <laughs> <laughs> Can you remember that? Last, was it oh, last year? Oh, this was Christmas. Christmas. It was Christmas. So Laura gave... Um, <laughs> we got Gaz a bottle for his uh, for Christmas, and uh, that's that's all we buy each other whiskey. <laughs> we know it goes to a good home. Uh, Laura sent Gaz his Christmas present last uh, at, at Christmas, and I says, "Did you take Gaz his present?" She says, "Yeah." I said, "Not that bottle." She said, "Yeah, why?" I said, "The bottle the bottle you've took him's mine, and it's got like a third of it out." <laughs> She left me full one and took you <laughs> an yeah, already empty one. opened one. <laughs> right. I know you're cheap sometimes, but come on. <laughs> I've taken the old uh, baffle. Uh, have you seen our knackered tyres already? Yeah, I, I saw that. I, that's that's one, one trip. Look, they're, they're almost on the... That's not good in one sense. 1,600 well, miles. I suppose normally it's way quicker. Yeah, they'd be great, but they don't last long, do they? So it's booked, it's booked in for service and uh, new tyres. A new tyre to go back on, ready for PCOS. Well, that's How not you... long. No, it's not. Four weeks, isn't it? I'm having the same tyre on. You can see how good they are, look, because the old chicken strips are nearly gone. It's not bad on a knobbly tyre, that is it. Haven't got a clue where we're going to go. Or what we're going to do. You ready, pal? Have you seen pictures from Mission Impossible thing? We're, we're train going off. I can't wait to see film, see what happens. Are, are they tie it in, I mean? I wonder what uh, situation is now. There's got track still there, look. I wonder if you can get into it now, it's uh, finished. How exciting that though, it would have been amazing to meet him up here. It'll be dead interesting to see how they tie that into the film to to look like it's hurtling down a full train track somewhere and then all of a sudden it goes off the edge there now then can we get into it now or not probably still closed well all the uh, tents gone yeah it's closed look do not enter Oh, have you not been up yet? Here we go, folks. This is where they just recently flirted the train off. Have a look at these pictures now. Press pictures of the train actually going over the edge.
I can't wait to see how they do this. I've gone right through dirtiest bit that I didn't want to. <laughs> That's just going through quarry. Yeah. Oh, look at my head. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's just test this. You've got 84%. Yeah. Just don't bother plugging it in for a minute. Yeah. Let's just have a ride around because there's enough to take you down to breakfast anyway. Yeah. So just see, the lead could be doing something to force it to shut down. Just try it. If it shuts off without external power, yeah. Then we need to think about something else, but... A cracky morning for it. And it's Gaz's birthday today! Yay! <laughs> 21! <laughs> what, what actually is it, Gaz? 30... 38. What? 38. <laughs> My age don't bother me. Nah, it's nothing mate, nothing. I remember, I remember approaching my 30th thinking, this is terrible, this is just terrible. And then after that, it just gets better anyway. I about to say, I enjoyed my 30s more than my 20s. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Do you know, because you're a bit more financially stable, you can do a bit yep. more. But if it, yeah, do you know what I mean? You're a bit more financially stable, that's Gaza's way of saying he's rich. <laughs> have you met my, well, have you, have you met my well, wife and kids? There's no such thing as rich in my <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that's weird, isn't it? Why would they cut that little bit of grass out there? They were. Probably Clarkson's out practicing. Have you seen all photos from Diddley Squat Farm? Anytime it's open, it's rammed. Yeah, packed. Jesus. When I called through with Pete that day, it was sh it was short, so there were no one there. So <laughs> yeah, it's only open Friday, Saturday, Sunday, something like that. Yeah, they've had to they've had to extend one at Fields, aren't they? Massively to to accommodate all cars. I can imagine. It's a lovely morning for it, anyway. It's all right having a pitch and put on your back garden. <laughs> oh man. I've been to Grindleford for ages. We started venturing to uh, Ambergate, didn't you? Yeah. Me make that food's mega. Absolutely mega. It's just not, not suitable for a load of bikers because there's nowhere to park. But like this morning, it would have been perfect for us, but obviously we're over this way, so might as well go here. It's quiet down here this morning. Right, Mr. Jenks. Morning, pal. Morning. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to move these bars. That's twice now it's done that. Yeah. Alright then, we're going to get some breakfast. Uh, has, it, has the camera stayed on? Yeah, it stayed on, that's nice. No, but if, if it's doing something, or if it's not like um, connecting properly, or if it's a bit jittery, it could force it to... You know, it's telling the camera something's not right here, so the camera then shuts down to protect your file. Maybe. But it's weird how it stayed on. Did you get one of these? You had one of these, didn't you? Yeah, um, it's somewhere, mate, it's somewhere in ass. Yeah. And, um, I just find that kind of material better because it don't, don't stick yeah. on anything. This is a charger leaf for one of these, like, uni lights. Is it? Yeah. Oh, have I ruined your photo? You can have it. I left keen ignition. <laughs> <laughs> I must not have had a ladder seen it. <laughs> Right, gents. Good to see you. Cheers, bye. See you soon.
it's nice to chew the fat with everyone, isn't it? Yeah, it is, mate. Yeah, you know, sitting around that table talking PCOS. I'm itching now. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm itching for it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I think that's part of Trans-European Trail up there. I have to go up there one day. Do you notice a big difference from off-roading with nobblies on compared to like normal roads on? Um, it does bite more. It's like that, for instance, when we were in Ireland, um, we'd done this one little bit of Martin's tyres, although they, they say they are 50-50s, they don't look 50-50s at all, they look like normal, like 80-20s, you know. And he were, um, seemed to be spinning a lot more than me, so that could be down to technique, I suppose, but uh, yeah, you, like I say, you can feel them bite a bit. Oh. But the road riding, it's exactly the same. I, f I find these, st these stick just as well as any tyre. Yeah, you definitely know slower. Definitely, you know, if anything, I'd say you're getting a bit more more confident in that, and you, if if anything, you, you seem quicker. In that quicker, the, you're just getting quicker and quicker. I mean, for instance, if you if you jumped on this, you'd feel you can feel them when you first get on it. They definitely don't move. But you know, I've I've ridden in in, in rain now, no problem as well. Although you'd, you know, you don't give it chance to spin, but you can still ride it, you know, comfortably. I do, like I say, if I ever have an Africa Twin, which is a possibility, I think I'd definitely have the DCT though, yeah. definitely. Yeah, it's a, it's a winner for me, mate. I, I absolutely love it. Like, Pete swapped his Africa Twin. I said, you going for another manual? He's like, yeah, yeah. But I'm like, it's like, DCT is just not fair. And I went, well, that's fair enough. I said, because it's, it's not for everyone. I says, but I think I would go down the DCT route. You've got to have time on it though to to appreciate it really um, someone said to me the other day don't you miss changing on your own or being in charge of the gear changes and I'm like well I am in charge of them yeah I saw that comment actually and you put, did you put something like well I am 90% of the time yeah but when I'm like riding spirited I'll always put it in manual always so I can ride it myself you know but when you're just tootling for a you know a breakfast or whatever I'll leave it in sport auto which is still you still kind of control that a lot as a lot of it as well you know uh, certain braking points or engine revs dictates what gear you're going to be in you know so even in sport mode you can still control it really well like Picos for instance it'll be in manual the whole time you've not took twin to uh, Picos yet have you no it's always been on VFR your last time we were on VFR, oh, wasn't it? Yeah, my last time on VFR, so I'm lucky, mate, you could offer me any bike and I wouldn't take it. If you said to me, oh, such a, such a of countries with these bikes, you want one for Picos, I'd be like, no, I'm not interested, I want to take this. Because if I'm honest, the reason I've gone for the XR is because of the Picos, and the motorway miles down there, it's nimble, it's light, and it, but it's comfortable. So it's kind of the reason I went for this for that type of trip. <laughs> You're taking time. That's the first one today, let me add. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. I'll give you the it is. It is. <laughs> to be honest, that were a big one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, folks, we're done. Thanks for watching. Gaz's little birthday ride. Hope you have a good day, Gaz, whatever you're doing for the rest of the afternoon. It's nice to go out just for a little no-nonsense ride. All right, folks, that's it, we're done. Thanks for watching. Gaz is going home to enjoy his birthday. Not sure what we just captured because his camera has been acting up a bit this morning. But uh, I guess you'll know that by now because this is the end of this little video. So, hope you have a good day, pal. The rest of your birthday. Thanks for a good ride, mate. Ha, ha, ha.